My sincerest pardons, friend. I did not mean to bother you on your stroll. Might I walk behind you in good faith? If you are unafraid of such company, of course. Some find it most bothersome. <laughs> you are too kind, my friend. Truly, I appreciate it. Walking alone in the woods can be very liberating. I quite like it, though it seems people often aren't keen on my company. Well, you won't even look at me for one. You think I am playing a game of some sort. That is quite the accusation, my friend. Why would you assume such a cruel thing of me? No, you are playing a game, and you know of exactly which sort. You're just curious if I'm playing or not. If I'm even aware of the game. How can I play a game when you will not acknowledge me? Will you not even turn to look at me? Almost all games must be played with some sort of acknowledgement of the other player, no? Otherwise you're simply playing alone, which you seem to be under the impression that you are not. <sighs> then will you heed the serpents before you? They are quite vicious. You turn my serpents to crows. Are you a witch then? Hey, confound you. You cannot begin a game and then walk away. This isn't how you play with me, not me. You turn my wolves into domestic pups and send them to run and play like fools. Fine. If wolves and serpents are not to your taste, then how do you feel about the cold, nightmarish indifference of insects? <laughs> no human enjoys the company of the swarm. You, you, you cheeky little creature. Do you think you can grin and dance and make a mockery when you are in my home? You have no concept of what I am, none like you do. So face me. And now you look upon me, the lord of this forest, you disrespectful little. Do you have no heed for your own life? Do you not know the rules? Those that wander alone at night tend not to care much for their own lives, my friend. Your ability to look upon me without fleeing is admirable, but it will not save you. The moment you tip your hand... Hey! Do, do not walk away from me! Confound you! Pay attention to me! Acknowledge me! Your magic cannot protect you against everything which, the moment you drop your guard... Oh, fine, fine! I do not need you to notice me to maintain my power, you festering little sore. Acknowledge me. Acknowledge me. 
Why won't you talk to me now? Why do you pretend to be so fascinated by the damned fireflies instead of the monster walking in your shadow? You should be terrified. You should be running for whatever life you have left. You should be running for whatever life you have left. Oh, please, I beg you, a simple touch, a look, please. I will do anything if you just pat me on the head. Will I reveal my true name if you pat me on the head? Yeah. My true name in your tongue is fear. Oh, thank you. Oh, God's the relief. May I be your lover? Why? No one has ever tolerated my company for more than a bit of good fun. A thrill. You were never afraid. I've never even thought of having someone that could stand my company. I may not seem it, but I am powerful. I could provide anything you desired. Riches, gems, power. Anything. Uh, thank you. I'm grateful to you, Master. I swear my loyalty and obsession to you. As long as you will stand by my side. Uh, if you wish me to lie here and let you pat my head then very well whatever pleases you i am yours for however you wish to have me or use me mm -hmm. whatever pleases you but i have a question what do i call you God, oh. as you wish, anything you wish. Let's go ask shit.